Hey everyone, Lensmanos here and welcome to another First Look game. This time it's a game by the name of Turn On and it's by Brainy Studio LLC, both developed and published. It's released on the 1st of June, so depending on when this video goes up for you, it may be on that day, it may not, I might be a day early, but um, it's effectively a platforming game, but uh, with a little bit of a difference. Um, you, you play a... Uh, they're calling it a brave alien creature uh, and um, his journey through a blackout world so you'll, you'll see what I mean when you first get in uh, just a word of warning the the intro video is a little bit louder and I can't control the volume on that so I may try and uh, turn it down a little bit in post but we'll see how it goes about you but when my power goes off it all goes off at once <laughs> all right so here's the intro to the game basically this little creature has crash landed uh, on on earth and taken all the power out with him here he is here so the premise of the game is I'm gonna I'm gonna use my, my Xbox Xbox controller here um, we play this little electric ball thing and the idea is to um, follow the power lines and um, you collect points by collecting the little um, blue lightning bolts if you pick up a green one you gain extra kind of heart up in the top left corner and we can jump between um, these rails once I get the ability to it, it uh, tells you how to do that in a second um, so I, I currently can't jump or anything, but um, we'll be able to do that in a moment. Basically, we're putting power back into everything in the world. Now I can't can't jump across here yet. But yeah, I sat down to play this. It, it, uh, the devs very kindly gave me a copy of the key, um, along with uh, there's a, a, a partner program. That basically means that uh, if you guys buy the game using uh, my link down below, I will get a proceeds of the, the purchase price, well, a, a portion of the purchase price, I should say. Um, so, yeah, if, if, if you're interested in the game and you like the look of it, by all means, go and give it a look, see, and pick it up. It will help support me as well. All right. These little boxes are kind of a save point. I think this is where it tells me I can jump. Yep, okay. So A, M, a to jump, B to drop. Um, with that being said, I'm going to go back a, a level. And we're going to just try and pick up a couple of extra points I didn't get in my first playthrough. See, you fall off, you die. Um, then we reload. Here we go. So let's turn that aircon on. Couldn't remember if I could get things in that previous part. I didn't quite get, um, I didn't get an amazing score on this first level when I first played it. And it's just looking for all those little things that you can um, power up, so to speak. Um, so yeah, definitely um, I sat down to just sort of test what the game was like and I ended up playing it for about, I don't know, about 45 minutes I think it was. I sat here and I went through about, I don't know, um, five or six levels. Uh, they're all there's all a little bit varied there's some um, some more of your traditional sort of 2d type levels like this and then there are a couple that um, are a little different and more of a, a 3d affair let's turn this on uh, there's no spoken word in it either it's all told through uh, like you can the basic sounds that the guy's making and uh, there's no there's no dialogue so to speak all 
Ah, did better this time. Alright, next level. Is our save point? So yeah, this this is you know what what the game is. It it's coming around, and I'll I'll try and ooh, try and um try and get to the the next type of level, so you guys can see what it's like. So let me just cruise through here. I want to make sure I get all the uh, all the bits and pieces. I don't know if that goes somewhere. Does it get zapped? No. Okay, now there's a jump out here. Alright. I don't know if I can... No. Oh, I missed it. Darn! I don't want to go back here yet. <laughs> get that other one. Ah, beat it. All right. So yeah, let me grab that guy. Let's see if we can get through. I just want to demonstrate. Definitely want to demonstrate that next level time. Ah, oh. almost got it. Oop. That's that one. Hey. I can hear you, buddy. You don't have to keep saying hey to me. Oh, I hear you. Hey. He just wants me to go through these things. And I did miss one. I could, probably could have got a uh, an air conditioner back there, actually. Don't know why this guy has this in his basement, but whatever. Next level. Whoa! Ho -ho! Again, very cool little um, way of telling the story without um, needing to have a language. All right, now this is a, a bit of a different sort of level. This one is kind of like a kind of like a music game. Uh, you can only touch the blue wire. You can't um, you can't touch the or you can't survive on the um, on the non lit up wires. And you saw there, I got I touched the red lightning bolt and I, I lost a lightning bolt from the uh, the top left there. But the idea is basically the same deal, but just collect up the little lightning bolts, and that gives you score. But um, with that extra bit that you can't touch, um, anything other than this one wire. Um, the level I did get stuck on was another one of these levels, and um, yeah, I, I tried it like seven or eight times and ended up just going, you know what, <laughs> I'm done. I need to uh, come back another day and play this one. This is just sped up on me. I can't slow down. I can't um, control my character in this this level. It's just whatever the um, speed of the game is. There you go. Didn't do so great at the end there. Oh, got three lights, so that's cool. Right, so this is where we got like a level select screen. So there are plenty of levels, again, um, there are things that we'll get to as we go go through. Here you go, welcome to Electro City, explore the coast, 
and bring electricity back to the homes. So, you know, we've now had a regular sort of 2D, so to speak. And this is a little bit 2D as well, but it's got a perspective difference. Um, so we've gone through a, like a music game as well, and, and now we're into another more of a 3D arrangement. So you can see there's, there's depth to these ones now. It's not just him going through a, uh, a factory environment. And um, yeah, like so this in itself, a couple of different types of um, game in one. Quite impressed with the uh, the graphic style. I do like it. It's um, it's just uh, funky enough to keep it interesting. And I definitely like the the way that the devs have um, told the story without needing to uh, use their words. <laughs> okay, so basically this level is just going through and trying to light everything up. But yeah, go and check it out. Um, links in the description below like I always do. Um, Turn On by Brainy Studio LLC. Um, it is available on Steam. Um, not sure of Steam costs because the game hasn't been released yet as as of this. But um, I do believe there is a pretty decent deal on the, the link I've got down below. Um, well, there was when I first checked out the link. It was only two days ago. Um, there's a, a pretty, pretty good discount on it. So I'm not sure if that's before release or what. But by all means, go and check it out. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm going to play this for a little bit longer. It, it is just one of those games that you sort of get stuck into and play through. Um, trying to beat your score each time. Um, seems to be a lot of uh, Steam achievements for anyone out there who likes doing Steam achievements. Um, and I do believe there are trading cards. So, by all means, turn on adventure indie casual platformer, basically, by Brainy Studio. Comes out on the 1st of June, 2000 and... Ooh, looks actually, it looks like it came out on the 1st of June 2016, according to Steam, but uh, yeah, I don't know, it's it's only just been started promoting now. Um, could be a typo, it could be when the Early Access came out, I'm not sure. Check it out, good little game. Nice cheap price through my link, and I do get a portion of it, so being up front there. Um, anyway, thanks for watching, comments below, and I'll see you next time. Bye now.